Hello guys, welcome into Watson's Playbook. And I decided that I'm going to do some reviews on this um, YouTube channel. This is my first YouTube channel I've ever had. I um, I do a podcast show, Watson's Playbook. You can find the, the Facebook page, Watson's Playbook on Facebook. Or you can go to watsonsplaybook.buzzsprout.com and check out my official podcast show. Now, this is the YouTube channel, obviously. Um, I have been working on trying to figure out if I want to podcast on YouTube. A lot of people do it that way, where they're where you can see them talking. Um, I didn't know if a lot of people wanted to see me talk, but I kind of like the idea where you can, you can, I can talk. I do a lot of talking with my hands here, but um, I don't know. I just kind of like that that feel for it, but I'm just going to see. I maybe, maybe later down the line, I can get a camera and get some better um, footage for you guys. I went ahead and I got me a microphone. I started my, my podcast a couple weeks ago about sports and it's about family and it's about my life, um, my opinions on different things in, in that matter, um, reviews on movies I've seen with my wife, um, everything else in between. So come take a listen. Come take a look. I'm going to review some stuff today about beard care, uh, beard care products, my beautiful beard here. Um, it grows in a little kind of crazy and wild, but I like it. So, um, if you, if you do want any kind of beard tips or any information, you can always come here or there's a guy, um, on YouTube. I get a lot of my information from him. Um, well, when I first started out on how to take care of a beard, the different oils, cause there's oils and bombs and all sorts of stuff for beards, right? So beardtube.com or beard tube on YouTube. It's a, it's a YouTube page. Um, he has a, lots of information on beards and and um, that's where I get my information from on kind of different suggestions on what companies I should buy my products from and I test them out myself so I've, I've tried a different couple companies here and the first one um, first one I, I, I tried was a place called Live Bearded and I saw them on Facebook as well I really like the message it's just about a uh, kind of a brotherhood of of um, bearded people and i really just like the message they 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 sent so when i first started i ordered some um some beard stuff from them but then i tried tried a beer balm from some of them. so there's a there's waxes there's bombs now there's butters and there's oils and oils are great i'll get into those in a second the beer bombs and the beer waxes i hated i got I hate it. They were very hard to put in your beard. You know, very hard to get out of the container. Very hard to have it um, disintegrate in your hands and get it in you actually work it in your beard. And I hated them. I said, there's got to be a, something better. And that's when I found this beard butter um, from Live Beard. This one's a legend. It's a vanilla sandalwood scent. It's very, very good. Um, so I started using that and putting it in my beard. Man, what a difference it made. It made it soft. It, it um, re-moisturized the beard. And, and that's the thing, too. I got a, lot of, I got a buddy of mine that says, I can't, keep, I can't grow a beard out because it itches a lot. And he, he shaves it. So this will keep that from doing that. And oils will as well. And conditioners and all that good stuff for your beard. And um, a lot of these products are, are almost the same. Um, with different scents they put a lot of the different of the same oils in there some have a different more expensive oil in it um but most of these are the same and, and as long as they're all natural stuff you'll be fine with what you put in your beer for the most part um i i, I like old spice you know deodorant shampoos and stuff like that but the old spice beer products don't use them yeah i have never reviewed it i watched the beer too he reviewed it a lot of the ingredients on there a lot of the product stuff on there and the ingredients was chemicals, not stuff. So this right here, this is shea butter, coconut oil, jojoba oil, um, avocado oil, almond oil, grapeseed oil. That's what's in here. It's all natural. It's going to re-moisturize your skin underneath your beard. It's going to keep it looking nice and fresh, nice and clean, nice and silky smooth, right? Um, I've tried different things as far as beard straighteners go. But I, I don't really like them. They, they don't seem to hold it too much. But, but the thicker the beard butter, um, the better hold it is. And this consistency, and I like, this is why I like these videos, is because you can see the consistencies, because they can come differently. Like I bought one at Walmart one time, I forget the brand, but it was basically lotion. And no one want, you don't want to put lotion in your hair, it just didn't feel right. So this consistency 
is nice. It's it's kind of thick, not too thick, not very hard to get out, but it's it's a nice uh, thick consistency. If I want more hold, I kind of use this one. Um, another one I try was called Husky Beer. They're actually from Canada, and the Canada one is it's called Husky Beard here. Boom! It's got a little husky on it. It's pretty cool. A little two ounce. This one's a. Uh, this one is uh, Autumn Night. It's kind of like a campfire, and I've already used it all, so I can't really show you the consistency. It was more of a kind of like a cool, a, a cool Whip almost, just a little bit um, thicker than that, but not not too much thicker than that. I, I really liked it. It a light hold, not very not very much of a hold, but I like the scent. And this was a the oil was a fresh squeezed. Now the oil is something usually going to come with a little dropper. If you've never bought these before, uh, this one's out. I've used it all fresh, and the oils is going to help get into that beard and um re-moisturize it so getting it look a little bit shiny getting it feeling good um oh also let me show you the beard husky beard you're gonna want a beard a beard brush sorry let me show you the beard brush here um it's just um, a great brush right it's just a, a really good brush and it's a boar head. You want a boar head brush, boar hair brush, to really um, get this hair looking all nice and nice and good. Um, this is one of my favorite ones, and it's called Artius Man. I actually got this one in today. Um, it's just one ounce bottle. It's, this is a this is called Midnight Ride, and it smells like uh, my wife says it smells like Christmas candy, but. Um, it's like a licorice cinnamon almost. It's interesting smell. These ones, this company does have some interesting smells, but I like the oil so much because of the fact it's the thickest oil I've used as far as beard oils go. So it stays in there longer uh, and their smells are unique. They have a citrus fire, it's more like a, a, a campfire, with, um, kind of an orangey kind of campfire. It smells pretty good. It's kind of, it's kind of hard to explain. Um, they will give you a, samples so if you go on there and order samples they send you a little mini bottle you can test out the the, the smells and um i just love companies that send out samples because before you go out and buy uh, the, the bigger bottles like that i want to know i'm gonna like the smell and then it's the same thing with the beer butter the consistency so check them out check Guardius man i really highly recommend them they're really really good um, there's another one called Badass Beer Care. I don't have any other stuff here, but I've used it before. Um, Badass Beer Care will send you um, sample packs to to test out their smells and their and their beard uh, beer butter. And the cool thing is, they send it, the beer butter is like a thing like this small. They send you a little guitar pick, pick it out, put it in the beard. Really good products, and it's also made by a um, the company is stationed out in California. But it's all, it's all veterans. All the v uh, veterans work there, and they created this company and started it. So if you want to uh, support the troops, which who doesn't want to support the troops, go buy their stuff. They're, they're really good stuff. And like I said, a lot of this stuff, as long as they got those ingredients and in you want to see the ingredients that go into it because you're putting them in your beard, um, are going to be good for you. It just depends on what kind of products you like. And I like these videos because you can see the consistency of the beard butters, and stuff like that so I, I found this one through the uh beer tube and this is a uh, it's called uh fresh beards and it's a moisture you know it's called black light this is a four ounce one and this one smells like heaven it just <coughs> sorry that cough had nothing to do with the smell oh but it smells like heaven and the consistency um a little bit thicker uh, but it go it, it emulsifies in your hand really really good and goes in your beard extremely well. So I highly recommend them. I'm gonna order more of their stuff. I need to order some of their beard oil. I like to try different companies and kind of just keep a collection of different ones that I, that I get. Um, but then I think when, when you're doing these things or getting stuff like this and, and anything, whether it's, um, I also like to try different root beers. You kind of keep that, you know, the special ones you like. So you always have a pack in the fridge, but then you try new ones. So I'm gonna get my my shelf on my top three and keep them always having. And this one's kind of interesting. I, I I don't I haven't really used the conditioner on my beard, but I've been hearing Scotch Porter conditioner. Scotch Porter, gotta get the Scotch Porter. And so I went out and bought me one. And they they recently changed the ingredients and they changed it to packaging for them. And I said I got. They said there's a guy on 
on Amazon that sells the original. So I had to try the original. I just had to. But this is a big, big container, right? It smells almost like a, I think it's a marshmallowy, yeah, like a smarsh, marshmallowy cream. Uh, I just dip my, I just dip my thumb in it. But um, it's a, uh, it is, man, it works amazing things. I used it the other day, and my, I came out of the shower and my beard felt so soft and um, smelled really good. So I'm gonna continue to buy these. Um, I think this thing is twenty bucks, um, which is not bad. They 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 changed up the the formula and container and the thing good thing about this container is i can get every bit of this out of here Sloop, scoop it on up right um now it's a squeeze bottle i hear they made the the thing thicker so but go try them out man scotch pour makes some good stuff there's a lot of good beard company brands out there that are going to shoot you, they're going to shoot you straight they're going to pick good uh products and i um ingredients in their in their stuff so you got to test out the ones you like i don't like bombs i like the beer butter um, beer butter is amazing so go try them out do not go to walmart and buy different different ones i don't know what they sell at target sometimes target sells more, some higher end things but the, the walmart stuff that they sell for beards is not not that great that's just some kind of things that i do and it goes in every day get up put the beard oil in brush it comb it through get it in there put the beer beer butter i'm fresh looking you know somewhat kind of clean um get out the door so i i really enjoy uh these beard products and i like to find new beard companies and kind of fill them out but so live bearded badass beard care um scotch porter husky artius man um and the fresh beards are, are my collection right now that i got going on there's another one i didn't name and i almost forgot about and they're really really good as well it's called um boss man brand and they made this thing it's the only one i've ever seen it's called beard jelly it comes in a eight ounce thing it's it's super great and it's a kind of a mix between oil and a butter and they kind of hit it together and um, i usually use it for nighttime if you need you need to what, what i've always been taught is when you go to bed your beard will dry out pretty fast so put some of that stuff in there um, i like to use the beard jelly it's perfect for that um, so go check those out try them out for you hopefully you got some good tips for me um, if you have any questions just uh come on here and ask me my email is b the number two the watts t-h-e-w-a-t-s dot com you can email me there um hope you find me on watson's playbook on facebook page click the like button click the scroll subscribe button here i'm gonna be doing a podcast right now every other week and probably trying to video it as well um as i talk to you guys but other than that i hope you guys have a great weekend it's, it's almost tomorrow's friday and uh I guess, you know, we're all quarantined, right? Or you're supposed to be quarantined with your family. So hopefully you're not, not driving you too crazy and you're able to find some things to do to spend some time with them. So, but all right, guys, I appreciate you listening to this video. Hopefully you liked it. Hopefully you, you, you find these products out there and you, you use them and say, hey, that guy was right. All right, buddy. Take care. Bye.